Elijah on the pass to Mullen. Jordan dishes to Malone. Here's Elijah on. Good, and it's Malone picking up the assist. Malone's got six assists here tonight. Malone, an outstanding passer at the power forward position. He's got really good floor awareness and has a really good understanding of when to get the ball to the open man. Now here's Phillips. Banked in off the glass. Hey, height is just a number when you play with his tenacity and force inside. An absolute fearless approach by him to get the score. Here's Jordan. It's Pippen on the win. Wants to get it to Elijah Wan and does. And no good. Trying to use the glass. Hornets trail by seven. In the corner, Billups with it. And there's the pass to Petrovic. Outside, Kobe. Shot clock at six. Puts it up. No good on the shot. Good work defensively by Pippen. And here's Jordan. He'll bring it up for the Knicks. 17 points was their biggest margin. Nails the 16-footer. And the Knicks lead by nine. We know Jordan is a master from the mid-range, whether he's squared up or falling away. We feel like it's going to splash. Fills, defended by Mullen. Floats one. Here's Earl. Nice pass. Right under the rack perfectly for the layup. Boy, I like how Chauncey Billups looks to share the ball. He's a sturdy point guard with a great feel for when his guys are open. New York calls timeout. Checked in for Mullen. It's time now to hear from our Hall of Fame reporter, David Aldridge. What's the latest, David? Well, I had a chance to listen to the Knicks coach talk about the game with his team, and he was real calm during the timeout. He was smiling when he told the team, we're up. Game plan is working. Go out there and have fun. It's always fun when you're up late. Guys? Thank you, David. On the wing, Malone. Hard away against Billups. Charity swipe shot. Here's Malone. And Billups pulls it down. Hornets trail by seven. Ryan the pass to Williamson. And Williamson throws it down. Boy, Kobe much more than a shooter now. So good at getting it to his open teammates. Elijah on the wing. Dishes it to Pippen. New York, no good that time either. Boy, that's a squandered opportunity there. One he'd like to have back for sure. That shot wide open. Now just a two-point Knicks lead. And it's clear that Phillips is a gamer of gamers. This guy loves having the ball in his hands in these situations. Now here's Elijah. Nice shot from 10 feet out. Elijah has got 14 points now in the second half. Charlotte's gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. Ryan in the post, defended by Jordan. Loved the effort. Stuck with his man, got the hand up, and then he didn't hesitate to follow up with the rebounding duties. Inside. Here's Elijah on. That drops, and it comes off the assist from Hardaway. Now it's a six-point New York lead. And Hardaway, any Hardaway, boy, what a terrific passer he is. Great floor awareness and does an excellent job finding the open man. Now here's Kobe. And no good. Good D by Jordan. Outside Hardaway. No dice from the high post. He's a solid mid-range shooter, but just wasn't able to knock that one down. Outside, Phillips. Thirty 
26 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Rock at six. Nice pass in here by Charlotte. Shoots. And again, the Hornets missing. And now we've got the intentional foul. Drops the first one, and that makes it a seven-point lead. You know, there's so much that's amazing to me about Jordan, but his endurance stands out. He consistently gets stronger, it seems, as the game goes on. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's an eight-point game. And, you know, Clark, you never want to say never, but... <laughs> yeah, you know, Kevin, at this point, I don't even know if divine intervention could turn this around. Knocks down the three. And you want to talk about being cool under pressure. Petrovic is simply outstanding in the clutch. First free throw missing for him. We'll see if he can nail the second. Pretty much a six foot seven point guard. Penny is a unique talent and a fan favorite. Heck, a broadcaster's favorite as well. I love watching him play. And the Hornets call time here. They're behind by six. We've got 13 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Guys, your thoughts? Boy, they need to respond fast. Preferably a three if there's a clean look. We've got 13 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. And he commits the intentional foul. Well, I think the foul was his only option to stop the clock. However, this is not a guy that you want at the line. Yeah, he did what he had to do. You can't just hope the ball gets past to a weaker shooter. the first one and that makes it a seven point lead so he goes two for two at the lock and it's an eight point game Charlotte calls timeout they're trailing by eight nine seconds left in the game guys your thoughts hey it's pretty simple if we're honest tonight they just weren't good enough at this point you start thinking of the next game because this one is finished. Nine seconds left in the fourth. Here's Petrovic. Let's the three fly. No good. So it's New York picking up the win. And that about wraps it up for this broadcast of the NBA Eastern Conference quarterfinals. For Mike Fratello, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, and our entire 2K crew, folks, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. So long. Please drive home safely, and we hope to see you again at the next.